Folks, you gotta check out Warrior Poet Apparel. It'd mean a lot, you're gonna look awesome, and it's clothes that actually mean something, right? So, what you doing? Yo, we're uh, asking folks to help support the brand, so. Wait, are they not? Well, yeah, they're, they're Let me at let me. No, 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 no. easy, easy, buddy, easy. You can't fight them, they're not here. That's Nick, that's the camera. They can say that. To my fist! No, 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 easy, easy, buddy, easy, easy. I had to put you down. Okay. I had to put you down. All right, I'm cool. You okay? Even if you fight them. I'm cool. That won't make them buy anything, right? Ah, you let me no, down. No, 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 I'm, I'm gonna put them down. I'm putting them to sleep. Good night. Shop Warrior Poly. Okay, I'll cover this. Good night. Good night. A little eye cut from there. <laughs> <laughs> All right, everyone, so I normally don't make videos about something as silly as a pair of pants. But since EDC is life and Vertex Defiance jeans are my favorite pair of jeans I've ever had, I've decided to share their existence with you. Uh, I'm now wearing these pants about four to five days a week. I love them because they have the functionality of cargo pants, nearly the comfort of sweatpants, but you won't be single forever because you wear them in public. Guys, as a public service announcement, don't wear cargo pants and sweatpants out on the town. The only girl that likes that used to be a dude. Foul ball. Anyway, okay, so now pants. These are the Vertex Defiance jeans. They're awesome. I've been wearing them for the past couple months, and I love them because they are, first off, stretchy. In the words of Nacho Libre, a very wise man, he said, sometimes men wear stretchy pants in their room for fun. It's true. And uh, I really like this. I want my pants to feel kind of like pajamas, the tactic cool whatever dude in me wants to be able to drop down on a knee and be able to shoot or uh, peek around corners and not have to hike up my pants to get down on my haunches kind of thing. That's important to me. I want stretchy pants. And so it's just more comfortable. And as soon as you start wearing stretchy pants, uh, this has like, this is 71% cotton. Uh, I think it's 4% polyester, 7% modal, 17% cool max. Oh, I'm really straining my uh, uh, memory here. Cool Max, and that's like helping regulate body temperature and whatnot, so it's not holding a bunch of heat, and you got like in the pockets right here, it's cool mesh stuff, which is see-through, so that helps keep temperature down all the way around. Really clever idea, but anyway, and then it's got 1% lycra in there, and all that adds up to be a nice uh, stretchy pants deal. You need to be able to roundhouse kick someone in the face at any given moment without having to hike up your pants. I believe Chuck Norris would endorse these pants for that fact alone, right? So first off, they're stretchy pants. The next thing is because they have 11 pockets in them and they look just like a normal pair of jeans. 11 pockets. Here they are. One and two in the front, and then the watch pocket, which no one uses for a watch anymore. So it's a change pocket or a little whatever pocket. Uh, in mine, I have all kinds of, I've got some cords, and I've got some uh, lock-picking shims, and I've got a little miniature USB thumb drive. I don't walk around with all this stuff in my pants at all time. I'm about to unload all kinds of secret squirrel escape evasion tools and whatever, and it doesn't mean I actually carry it all the time. It's just to say, I do carry some of this stuff, uh, like my lock-pick sets I always have on me. Uh, but anyway, it's just kind of an idea in case you want to be able to load out your stuff. And because it's jeans, you don't have to wash jeans very often. I was reading, this is fun little tidbit fact, uh, the CEO of Levi Strauss, forgot his name already, just read the article. He said he had been wearing the same pair of jeans without washing them for a year. And a lot of people thought that was really gross, but he's like, nah, jeans, you don't have to wash as much. And maybe that was overkill. I don't know how many friends that man has. But anyway, you don't have to wear jeans, you don't have to wash jeans very often. So I barely ever wash these. And funny also that the, the CEO, when he did wash them, he'd just walk into the shower with them on and he'd kind of like soap them up and air dry them. And he'd do that like twice every, you know, half a year or so, four times a year. So uh, anyway, jeans, you don't have to wash them very often. So if you're loading up all these little pockets, these secret pockets as well with stuff. Don't be washing your jeans all the time. Then you just got to take it out and put it in. Sorry, that was a little bit of a long tear, but I didn't know that about jeans until somebody told them to me. You don't have to do it like khakis and whatever where you're washing them all the time. Okay, so I've got three pockets here. One, two, and three. In the back here, you have your normal pockets, one and two, so that's five. And then also you have these 
kind of angled pockets and you can do whatever you want up here. It'll uh, house most smartphones. This is an AR mag just to show you how things could work there. So uh, that's three in the front, five and seven. Here's another little secret pocket right here. And this I, a really neat thing. I was able to put my little lock pick sets in here, which is awesome. Cool. And uh, my buddy, uh, Brian Black, he's got a company, ITS Tactical, and all these little escape evasion tools of the cordage, the shims, and the lock pick sets. Once I learned how to pick locks, I'm like, man, I'm just, please let me get locked out of my house for practice, right? So anyway, I, I do carry these with me everywhere I go. I just had normally put them in my wallet, and now I've got this nice handy dandy little thing, and it's held in place uh, one by just kind of friction. It holds in pretty well there and my belt helps solidify it so it's not slipping out anywhere. So that's another one. So two, four, five, six, seven, eight. We're up to eight. Now the others are on the inside. Pretty cool. Right here at the uh, very back, this is yeah, the back of the jeans here. There's a little pouch here and you can put something like a little handcuff key. There's a handcuff key right there. All this stuff, the escape evasion kind of tools, pretty cool. I'd mention ITS Tactical. Use my code WARPOET. It'll save you money. That also goes for Vertex jeans and anything you buy from Vertex. These things are about 66 bucks at the time of making this video. That's a tad high for me, but when you put in my discount code for Vertex, which is really nice, like 25, 30% or something, now it's 50 bucks flat, and I think that's good value for what you're getting. Back to pockets. Man, my head's like a, a bag of stray cats. I'm talking pockets, then I'm talking price, then I'm talking uh, ITS, blah, blah. Anyway, so you got this. Here's a little pouch right for you there, and it's neat because if you're I'm not advocating escaping handcuffs, but if somebody unlawfully detained you where they'd have your hands behind your back, well, there your little handcuff key is. Here's another one right here on the side. And I didn't really have anything that could go in there that wasn't falling out. I put a couple things there, like this little USB drive, and it wasn't staying, so I, I jettisoned that. So that's 10 pockets so far. The 11th is right here. Look away, ladies. Uh, Dumb joke. Uh, right here in the crotch, and I've got a rolled up $20 bill. I have got a little razor blade, which is pretty cool. Get out of flex cuffs or something. And then I've got a little uh, diamond file here. You can, given enough time, you can saw through just about anything. So uh, anyway, that's pretty cool. Also, underneath the belt loops, this is kind of built in. It's hard to see on camera. But underneath all the belt loops built in is like a, a, a little pass-through system. So even if you wanted to run like uh, communications, you had comms, you were working some security detail, you could uh, lace that through. And it's also got pass-throughs, I know, in the change pocket. Uh, but you can run all the way through every single belt loop, flex cuffs, rats, tourniquets, whatever, you, whatever was your pleasure. And it holds it nice, securely, and tight all the way around. I'm not going to lace it all the way through but it passes through every buckle, and I think that is a bit of all right as well. Some other cool stuff is in the back pockets. It has kind of a wallet trap system. So right now my wallet's in there, and it's not coming out because it's basically got this fold-over piece, which you'll, you can put your passport or your wallet back in there, and because this fabric folds over it, you can't pickpocket me, and it's not going to fall out. So uh, you basically just lift, and then there's my wallet right in there, no problem. So that's really good. I'm about to be traveling uh, internationally, not too long here in the future, and that means this is really, really good for being able to uh, have uh, my valuables there so I can't get pickpocketed in crowds in foreign countries. So uh, pretty cool as well. Another thing is little tether tie-downs inside the pockets here. So if I pull out these pockets, which again, is kind of wired through with that mesh material. There's my earplugs, which I always have on me, and chapstick cherry, because I stole it from my wife. Man, I'm gonna get a whole bunch of comments on that. I stole it from my wife, Roger. All right, cool, so inside the front pockets are these little anchor point tie downs, so you can tether stuff, tie stuff down, or connect something to your keys. This is our little new Warrior Poet keychain thing. Uh, put your keys there and you can stick this to a belt loop, but since I have anchor points inside my pockets right there, you can even do it like that if you had something you didn't want to lose. Uh, so I think that's really cool. And uh, anyway, yeah, that's vertex pants. I think I mentioned articulating knees and the gusseted crotch, so it's all opened up there for more room right there. And uh, 
right there as well. So when you sit, your pants don't hike up and you can also drop down on your haunches very well because the articulated knees. Anyway, for all that, not a bad value for 50 bucks if you use my uh, coupon code WARPOET when you check out at vertex.com. Really cool. Again, if you're interested in all this escape evasion kind of craft stuff, little compasses and cordage and whatnot, visit ITS Tactical. All the links are below so that you don't have to worry about landing on the wrong page. And if you use code WARPOET, it'll save you some cheddar. Anyway, I think that's a good review. There's a review on pants. It's funny. Um, as a tactical trainer, that's what I do. I travel the country. I'm teaching uh, tactical pistol, rifle class, concealed carry stuff, and uh, some small unit tactical room clearing, blah, blah, blah. But anyway, you'll pour your heart into making some good video for everyone. You know, of like, I really want to help people. I want to help keep the good guys alive and give you something that you'll be able to save your life with. And so, uh, or we're doing some run and gun thing and shooting and, and, you know, tactical trainers like myself or shooters in general, putting out content, we want to do a really good job. And then we communicate this stuff to everyone. And then lo and behold, no matter how hard we try on that video, no, how, no matter how much experience and thought went into it, the comments are like, so uh, what kind of pants were those? And we're like, oh, come on. Why do you care about my pants? And so uh, anyway, that's kind of like a joke that uh, I've talked about with other trainers. who are like, yeah, put in, a, put in a bunch of effort into a video and they're just going to ask you about your pants anyway. So anyway, this one is for you guys who want to know, hey, what kind of pants are those? There you go. EDC is life and Vertex is my jam. So uh, anyway, train hard, train smart. We'll see you next time, guys.